don't run through this area. <laughs> just might trip. Howdy folks, Sean here from Hiking with Sean on YouTube. And today we are at the Todd Fink Heron Pond Trail at the Cache River State Natural Area. So it has a, uh, it's been raining and uh, based on some photos I've seen on Facebook, the uh, Heron Pond looks a whole lot better than it did before. And I'll link, uh, I'll link the video up above where you can see it to see the Heron Pond all dry and miserable looking. So do check out that video. It's worth seeing at least for a comparison between a good looking heron pond and a very dry and sad looking heron pond. <clears throat> it's one of my favorite spots to visit. I'm here a lot. I've done quite a bit of videos on the Cache River and it just rained recently so hoping it looks good alrighty so we're here at the uh, confluence of the two muddy streams and you can kind of see how the water changes it's kind of neat the flow And I gotta say, it's looking really good. Uh, from the last time it looked, when you could you could cross it on foot, it was so low. Like there's a kind of rock stage area over over there where the water's a little bit more calm, and you can that was all showing. And the river looks really good right now. So, that makes me happy. Oh, this looks great. Try to get down here without sliding. Breaking a hip. <laughs> even kind of has a little fog to it that's cool yeah I'll throw up another video above you can see this place really foggy it's awesome check out that video it's really cool that was a really fun day looking great. God, I love when cash looks great. More cool fog. <clears throat> That's pretty cool. Highly recommend coming out here after a good rain because you get you know, cool scenery like this one. And the water and all that's falling off the leaves. You can hear it all around. Big old tree. Not the biggest out here, but pretty big. <laughs> Plenty of benches. <clears throat> if you're local, you've never been to Cache River, you are missing out. Look at that, all that fog. That's awesome. 
big trees. Feel free to rewind that and pause it if you want to read it. <clears throat> Still trekking along here on the Heron Pond Trail. Enjoying it. Definitely doing that. Loving, loving all the fall. Just love the leaves falling. And it looks nice in the summer when it's all in bloom and green, but in the winter and fall, you could just see everything. Looks good. My opinion, at least. Alrighty. Taking the Heron Pond Trail. I'm already seeing parts of the swamp and it's looking good. Looks like some folks have put paint marks on the trees. I don't know if those were always there or if that's new. Seen a few of them though. Could have always been there and I just didn't notice it. Alrighty. We are on the boardwalk here at Heron Pond. Just met up with some people who recognized me from a Facebook group. That was cool. And I gotta say, it looks very nice out here compared to the last time I was here. Very nice. Just a nice, beautiful cypress forest. Bald cypress. <clears throat> Here's some frogs out there. Bridge is still kind of leaning. It's not too bad. It would be cool to see some otters out here if we could ever get so lucky. I'm not going to hold my breath on snake sightings. They're probably really into hibernation now. It looks good. Looks very good. A little bit of information for you. Historically, wetlands have been abused by being drained, filled in, channelized, or polluted. Just 
talks about the Cache River. Good information. Woodpeckers. 